morning YouTube. I'm here at Finkel Abbey near Durham and I'm here to try and shoot some long exposures using the Panasonic FZ82. So far it's certainly trial and error. I've got the camera on a tripod it's set to very slow shutter speed using an ND filter and I'm still trying to get the bracketing correct to make decent exposures. It's pretty much this is the composition I'm after. I've got the abbey in the background across the water there and I've got the camera set up to take that shot. So I've got the camera set up in manual mode and down to one second exposure and the ISO set to 80, keeping the shutter speed nice and slow, trying to get that motion uh, out of the water, nice smooth water, that's my plan. I'm also trying another method which is to shift the camera into artistic nightscape mode and that allows you a little bit longer to take the shot. So as ever, despite the fantastic landscape, I found myself doing a little intimate landscape shot as normal. Uh, I'll show you that uh, setup in a moment. So yes, we've got this uh, little collection of leaves and the swirling water behind. And I'm trying to shoot that in a portrait format. And uh, again, end day filter on, trying different settings and different uh, shutter speeds apertures to see what kind of shots I can get. So the next shot is looking up the river. Uh, I've got a little bit of running water this way. Some lovely autumn golden trees just in the sunlight in the background it's probably one of these photographs where I wish I brought the nick on but I've got the FZ82 that's set to ISO 80 so hopefully the images will be nice and noise free so this is pretty much the view I've got and I've just got this running water here in front of me and that's pretty much the shot I've got on the back of the FZ82 So the wind's picked up now and the light's changed a little bit, it's not quite as bright as it was. So I'm going to uh, call it a day and uh, see what I've got when I get home and get these on the computer. So now this poor fat lad is going to climb all the way up there and a bit more as well. It's a little windy now but this is an absolutely gorgeous location and I'll definitely have to come back. Yep, more stairs. Whew. Good cardio though. One thing from today, it's all been about experimenting and learning to use this camera in a different setting than I'd normally do to shoot a different type of photography than I'd normally do. And I'd urge anybody who has this camera to give that a go. It's easy to leave it in automatic modes and 
complain about the quality of the images you get but unless you try to get the best out of the camera then you won't succeed so if the photos are any good you'll have seen them by now and if not nobody ever gets to see this vlog at all If you've enjoyed this video please consider subscribing to the channel giving me a thumbs up that really helps the channel a lot and uh, I would appreciate it if you would all right I'm off to see if there's a defibrillator at the top of these stairs and uh, catch you again in the next video bye for now oh bloody hell me knees